It's all about fishing. It's all about hunting. It's all about the great outdoors. And it's all about Outdoors with Captain Roy and Cheryl. Good morning and welcome aboard. And uh, we got a good show lined up for you this morning. Cheryl, what's the first thing we need to do? Well, we would like to thank uh, Kenny Ray and Chuck Carr for our backdrop. Uh, Chuck Carr had this beautiful speckled trout uh, that he caught and, uh, and Kenny Ray. <laughs> He did the uh, deer and the turkey, or the hog, the uh, bull hog, and the turkey and the deer. And uh, yeah, Kenny had not only not only killed them, but he also mounted them himself. So uh, these, these fellas got got mud of a trout. Let me talk about this speckled trout a little bit. Uh, Chuck Carr caught this trout fishing in the Bay County uh, Championship uh, speckled trout tournament. Fish weighed seven pounds and fourteen ounces, and the Pug that he caught him on or one just like he was hanging in his mouth. That's a crazy convict. Uh, Chuck m made a lot of these uh, lures and sold them and probably a lot of you out there if they fish with the, the crazy convict. And Chuck is real talented. Whittled these out with his pocket knife. Can you believe that? Did all amazing. the painting on it. And, uh, that, he just did, did, a, did a great job on, on making those lures. And he's very talented. Kenny uh, did get the big bull hog up there. <laughs> Folks, that hog weighed, uh, we didn't weigh him, but he was, he was heavy enough that Kenny couldn't load him by himself, so he had to be a big hog. We figured he weighed about 300 pounds. And uh, he, he he did the mount on it, and uh, if you saw it last week, he forgot to put his tongue in, but he got, he got his tongue this morning, <laughs> Kenny. And uh, Kenny also killed a turkey gobbler that got mounted behind us, and, and uh, he did the mount on it, I think the tail and the beard, and we appreciate it, fellas. And sure, we also we got a good picture. Um, sure Bob Penninger killed this nice ten point buck out at Tyndall Air Force Base, and uh, we appreciate you guys sending us your pictures. And please be sure and email us pictures of your hunt or fishing pictures at CaptainRoy.com, and we can show them on the air. Outdoors at CaptainRoy.com. Outdoors, thank you. <laughs> Outdoors at CaptainRoy.com. If you email them, we'll be glad to be glad to get them on, and. Uh, we, I want to remind folks that uh, today is the last day that you can keep a speckled trout until March the 1st. The speckled trout season, it, it does close today. We open March the 1st. Say it one more time. Don't keep a speckled trout tomorrow. You can catch them, but don't keep them. And also, grouper season closes the month of February and uh, the month of March. And it, it's tendency set that reopen April 1st, but you know that could change. But anyway, the group of speckled trout, catch them, but do not keep them. And uh, speaking of speckled trout, uh, we're going to do some speckled trout fishing this morning. We've got a, a, lot, a lot, of, lot to do today, and I think you're going to enjoy the program. I enjoyed this fishing trip, and uh, it, this fishing trip was, oh, was filmed on Wednesday after Christmas, kind of cold weather. I took the flu after that, folks. <laughs> but I've been promising these people that, I, that I'm going to show that uh, picture. That's what I do. I take people fishing and they, I, I film it and I have something to show And it's a memory that they, they'll have for a lifetime. That's right. Mm -hmm. And we, we were fishing in Burnt Mill Creek and uh, again we were fishing up above the bridge. Water still, water still cold and we were fishing with the Captain Joe's Fish on base, uh, SS Miners. SS Miners, and uh, we'll, we'll show that in a little bit. And we, we caught 84 speckled trout, according to my records. Wow. And we're going to watch that fishing trip when we come back after a bird. <laughs> When you think of a successful hunting season, two things come to mind. Browning and CNG Sporting Goods. Browning is the best there is, and CNG Sporting Goods is your factory direct full line Browning dealer. CNG stocks Browning guns, camo, knives, scopes, gun safes, bows, and much more, including hunting and fishing license. Look over the new Browning BAR camo short fright and X bolt rifles. Why pay good money for anything less than a Browning? Browning and CNG, the best there is. Home of the experts. 
I'll tell you what I like about corn. I like the food, I like the price, I like the quality, I like the quantity of it. But what I like most about corn, steak, and egg is I like that friendly atmosphere that I always find when I dine out there. It's owned and operated by Linda and Willie Corn. They are the original, and they're open 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and their breakfast out of this world. And my favorite is the world famous Corn Heavenly Hash. Corn, steak, and egg, 804 South Tyndall Parkway. Silly Willie Lures, catch fish, throw it at redfish or speckled trout or mackerel or anything that comes swimming by. Dry the pop of those swim jigs, add some shrimp, and you've got a fish catching machine. Silly Willie spoons and jigs and pop of those swim jigs from Fish on Lures. Check them out at CaptainJoeFishing.com. Good lures, good prices. You'll find them at better bait and tackle shops. Silly Willie Lures, sounds silly, catches fish. Sunjammers on Highway 79 has you covered this winter for all your fishing needs. If you're hitting the flats in West Bay, we're your most convenient place to buy live bait. We offer bull minnows, live shrimp, and fiddler crabs. Headed to the river or that secret pond, we sell crappy minnows, crickets, and worms. Sunjammers on Highway 79 stocks all the rods, reels, and terminal tackle you need for a relaxing yet productive day on the water. Open Monday through Saturday, 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. Give us a call, 235-2281, and don't forget we stock the best fishing kayaks around. Check us out on YouTube.com slash Sunjammers for weekly fishing report. I won't tell me who you are. Let me tell you who I got as my guest today. And uh, that Mr. Glenn Williams. I got that part right, didn't I? That's yes, right. sir. Dennis. And this Mike? Mike. Mike Engler. Mike is. Mike, you're not, you're not a local, are you? Uh, Virginia. 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 Richmond, Virginia. Come all the way down here to fish with me. <laughs> oh, come all the way down here to fish with me, Captain Roy. Well, I, I hope we catch more than that one. Mike, you got one on? Yeah, He's pulling the boat around, that one is. Uh, I don't know about that one, Mike. Boy, going? he's pretty, isn't he? Pretty fish. Yeah, those are pretty fish. Not too bad, but he's not too good. There's they, some bigger ones here than that one. Okay, now, you know who time it is now, don't you? <laughs> come on, Glenn. Come on, Glenn. What? Come on, baby. Come oh, look at that. That's that a little better. That's a little better there. Oh, you got him? Yeah, that's pretty not a bad trout there. <laughs> All right. Was well, that, well, that fun now? Yeah, it's great. I love it. That's great. <laughs> well, the captain got another one on. I believe that trout got my, got my SS manner, too. He swallowed it. He just swallowed it. All right. Let me get it. Yeah, I can see it in there now. Look at that ass ass in there. Boy, he swallowed it. He wanted that one, didn't he? <laughs> Good. You got another one back there on the back. Mike? Is it yeah, Mike? Yeah, I got one right here. Got one. Hold him up there and we'll take his picture. I'll pull him up a little bit. Goodness, that one's taking off, isn't it? Yeah, that's a lot of Mike, that's a good that's crap. Yeah, that's a lot of Uh-huh. And that's it. Oh, that. lost him. Save me, save me the... And that's what they call the agony of defeat. <laughs> Glenn, what's, what's you, what are you not doing? Besides not catching fish, besides not catching anything. Let me check your bait. Looks all right, don't it? You no, you know you got a piece of grass on it. You get that grass off of it. You get a hook on that lure there? Oh, you're right here in Burnt Mill Creek. Right in the mouth of the big bio, about right where I killed about a 12 foot alligator about 30, 40 years ago. Man over there, looks like he must have his limit head in. Oh, we had doubles on there. I <laughs> Mike got his in. Oh, another one. Yeah, man. One <laughs> that makes an even dozen now if, I, if I've kept up with them. I'm supposed to keep up with them. Uh, I'm going I'm gonna keep oh, the right reel on him. Easy with him. Easy with him. Easy. Yeah, that's he's got a good one on. It's just about every cast. <laughs> wow, that's, yeah, that's nice. pretty big. Look at that. Yeah. Up, oh, you miss it? Right there. Get around where I get you and him both in. There you go. That's a pretty trout you got there, Glenn. <laughs> All right, you got it. And you got your mice got one coming in right, right behind. You know, I, I believe if a fella done this enough, he gets liking it. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit.
He's really yeah, big. He man. looks big if you ha hold him out <laughs> close to the camera, Mike. <laughs> we want big. <laughs> All right, that's here a pretty we go. fish. That is a pretty fish there, Mike. That's number 15. Yeah, I think that's 15. 15. Glenn has caught most of them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I caught. I caught about 14 of them. <laughs> 14, 15. I knew, I knew it was close. Mike, when you get him in, I'm going to see who's the biggest, mine or yours. I, I, I don't know. That's a nice trout. I think that's, I think that's pretty. It about looks like about, 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 about twins. Like brothers and sisters. Brother sister <laughs> you might have him a little bit there. I think, I think you got me a little bit. I think you got me a little bit. I believe that's 20 and 21. Glenn says he got a big one on there this uh, time. All right, Glenn, I hope he is. Fish. I see him down there. No, well, that water is really clear, isn't it? It is. Yeah, nice trout there. Nice fish, Glenn. Yeah. One of the bigger ones we're talking about. Yeah. Oh, I believe that's the biggest one we've caught, Glenn. No, I ain't that big. <laughs> <laughs> He's about, oh. about the prettiest one. <laughs> <laughs>